remember one time I was driving down Tamantun and I had just, I think it had been maybe a month that I moved to Kale, and my car suddenly stopped working. Everything shut down and it was 6 p.m. and it was raining and there was jam and I was freaking out and I didn't know what to do and I was calling my friends and then there's this guy that was like rolled down your window and I was like worried because there's all these fears about you know things that people do but my car just really stopped and this guy came out in the rain and he's like I've got jumper cables do you want me to help start your car and so we got out of the car and pushed the car to the side so it wouldn't block the traffic and then he was like helping me out and I just thought like that's amazing that's such a great like it's just such a nice gesture and there's a lot of good men out there and we should always be able to find ways to appreciate them. I appreciate somebody that is confident but doesn't need to prove himself all the time. It doesn't need to assert his confidence everywhere. I think I always talk about it's a quiet confidence is that he understands where he is, where he's going and and accepts it and he doesn't need to change who he is or challenge and because of his confidence it's like there's a lack of issues about insecurity and whatnot so you know when I have that dynamic with somebody my ideal partner would be someone that's confident uh, willing to have fun and spontaneous like me. I think it, I find that I like people like that because I know I have a very strong personality I'm not very passive I'm very aggressive and I have a way of doing things so it's always finding somebody that either understands it or is willing to go along the journey with me and not not hold me back so to speak so I need somebody to to go with the flow and be like I want to go to Thailand next month okay let's do it always respect her always appreciate her love her and find ways to tell her that she's beautiful every day.